as you can see i didn't make the intro to this video i mean i guess you can see what we're doing here uh went ahead and decided to to pretty up the frame a little bit since uh we're going to panama city you know in uh this weekend like four days maybe so i went to the store i got about six of these cans rust oleum satin protective enamel uh home depot carried them for about five bucks a piece and then another local store carried them for about nine dollars a piece it was really expensive and uh i got a cordless drill here with a couple batteries and some wire brushes and i had some dent pullers uh i wanted to pull this dent out it's in the truck it's been here since i bought it i didn't put it in here but it really irritates me and uh but those are too big i can't find a flat surface but uh we're painting the entire rear diff axle drums i pretty much everything leaf spring locks i mean i haven't done up in there and i haven't done up in there but this is where we're a few paint drips that's wet because I, I just finished off this um it's not completely finished like everything's done that side's not painted uh we've done the back the whole left side up until about right here this is about where the paint stops because we're going to take off this wheel take out the fender liner and then paint that if we clean it and then everything up here, front end, is getting painted, except this, because it's already black. But I should pull it together. So all we got to the left is the front, the side, and the rest of the rear end. So I'll put you on time lapse. All right, here we go. Truck's all finished. Everything on the frame, front end, rear end, everything, axle, painted. Everything's painted. I didn't make the, the time lapse super long because uh, this isn't a tutorial video, really. It's a, uh, I don't know really what it is. I wanted to make this video kind of short because uh, I definitely don't exactly know what I'm doing. So uh, the first time doing it, I just kind of, went with it off of uh what i've seen online and uh i think it turned out pretty good i'm just uh just hoping it it holds stays good but uh as you can see here everything that you can see is black it's all the empty cans it only took me four cans to do everything and i did a little bit more than what i was gonna do the axle's painted don't know how that's gonna hold because i didn't really clean the axle I was getting kind of irritated with the whole cleaning process. So I'm just gonna skip cleaning the axle. But uh, it is Wednesday when I'm recording this. It's been about four days because I haven't worked on it like nonstop. But uh, this is the last day of working on it until we uh, we had a Panama. So uh, plans for today were to uh, finish this painting job. Uh, I'm gonna go get an alignment later because you can see my wheels are kind of Kind of wonky right now and uh Kind of needing to fix that and I'm gonna start it up the truck hasn't started in about four days because it's been sitting here Oh, yeah There we go Because 
we're taking this thing all the way from Jasper, Alabama. Five hours down that way. I'm leaving tomorrow, but I'll be down there Friday. I'll be down there Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. All right. PCB. Here we come. You know why? You don't have the guts to be what you want to be. You need people like me. You need people like me so you can point your fucking fingers and say, that's the bad guy.
No! No, you can't record me. I'm a minor. Don't mind that static. No, if this is about to hurt my ears, bro. Nice. Yeah, sure. <laughs>
I don't even know what the fuck going on. Oh, <laughs> 
Hey, hey, what up, bro? Hit me up, Johnny Depot. You already know what's going on. We have PC oh, Vegan. Get, get this out here. This is for you, vlog. Hit that motherfucker. Come on. Oh, yeah. Get a bitch, y'all. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Your ass. Your ass. Do that bitch to Bowery. Uh-uh. Hey, 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 I did it. Double single. 
It's a double rim. No, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> you just can't shoot. You call the double rim, you can't shoot. Come on, Jay. Okay, if you can't hit number net, I want to hit number net. But a bu three C roll. Three C roll. Three C roll. Three C roll. But a hundred dollars, no bad board. Three C roll. What team you play for? Alright guys, one more thing before I end this video off. I didn't really film an outro for this video, but it, uh, it has been uh, a pretty good while since PCB. I'm just now recording this outro. It took a while for me to get the motivation to edit it because I was just, I don't know, it takes a lot of work. But I had to say a few things before I uh, ended it off. I want to I wanna thank uh, Jordan Seals. Uh, I'll put his Instagram right here on the screen for uh, helping me paint the frame. Go follow his Instagram and uh, his TikTok. It should be the same, I think. And I wanted also to give a, a shout out to my new hat company that I just started, uh, it's Copperhead Hat Co. Uh, we don't have any in stock yet, but we are working on getting that done. And we have an Instagram, uh, a TikTok, and a Facebook, so go follow those. I'll put those on screen. And uh, as you can see, we have some tires on the bed. And I just cleaned the truck yesterday. That's why it's all shiny. It cleans up pretty well. But uh, the next video y'all should see is this truck. Uh, I'm taking it next week, I believe, to go uh, trade for some... 24 by 12 wides on 35s i don't really have the cash on me right now so i'm giving them these extra tires and uh one thing also about the truck uh after i got it home in pcb it started running a little rough on the way home and uh it's been having some problems lately well i i'm thinking it's the fuel system I've changed the mass airflow sensor and the egr sensor but i got this fuel filter i'm gonna see if it fixes it and if not i'm gonna get a fuel pump and that doesn't fix it just gonna go down the list of parts this thing probably has 300,000 on every part it's had anyways it is an older truck but uh this summer i have a lot of plans for this truck i have a job lined up for me so i'm gonna be making a little bit of money and i'm gonna be putting some of that money into this truck i'm gonna try and get a motor for this thing this year a built motor i'm gonna build a motor 
I'm gonna buy a motor from a junkyard and build it this summer. I'm not gonna tell y'all what motor, but uh, th that's the that's the plans for this summer. It's 26s, not the 24s I'm trading for, but I'm gonna trade on 26s eventually, and uh, 37s, and then a built motor by the end of this summer, and it will have a stage four cam. I don't care what anybody says. Oh, I get a stage two, stage four is too much. No, this thing will chop. It will chop harder than any other thing. But uh, that's all I really wanted to say in this video. Uh, I hope the wait wasn't too long. I know it's not the best video, but I kind of just recorded a crap ton of clips and tried to put them together. But uh, that'll be that'll be uh, the outro. I hope y'all enjoyed it, and uh, hopefully the next video you see this thing will be on some bigger rims. I'm tired of these 18s. I know Kilby's saying something about it right now. Uh, go follow my boy Kilby. I'm going to put his Instagram right here. I know he's been waiting on this video. I'm finally getting it out for him. Also, again, go follow the, the hat company. Look out for that. They're going to be $35 a piece for these hats. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to create some more designs and some more colors in these. And I might do a different hat because I know everybody doesn't like this seven panel. But uh, hunting hats, anything, uh, we're going we gonna to get it done. This summer is the year for this truck. And uh, we're doing other big things. So I'll see y'all in the next one.